Hey everyone, this is Manly Badass Hero, and welcome to The Machine That Breathes, which is an upcoming survival horror game inspired by the likes of Resident Evil and System Shock, where you play a cyborg that wakes up in a hostile facility. Digging, digging, digging. The depths of the earth. I'm a machine in charge of finding and examining seismic activity, then sending that information to the surface. Beep boop. It's my stated purpose, and why I was created. So all you do is digging. 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 But one day, communication with the surface stopped. There was no procedure on what to do if that happened. So I just kept digging. 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 I thought I would do this forever even though there was no use for this. But eventually, something happened. I had a shutdown. The error prompt said, Lack of communication. Died of loneliness. Wow. What is loneliness? I did not know. All I could see was darkness. Your entire life purpose was digging, and being lonely. You sound like one sad robot wingy. The machine that breathes. So I believe this game actually has been developed for quite some time. I've seen screenshots and uh, previews of it for for quite a while. It's always been interesting, at least just the cover art is anyway. It's got a unique style um, in the screenshots. And it, it is kind of like, it looks kind of like an RPG Maker game, but it's, you know, a bit step ahead of that. Subject name, Nell. Request that a human brain be transferred to swap into subject of shell. The request was overridden in favor of a previous request submitted for an AI to be transferred into the shell. Processing resolution. Resolution would be overwrite the human brain with AI. It was taken remotely from somewhere else. Reason for request unknown. The AI has been injected. Shell is identified to be mostly synthetic. Organic brain, respiratory system, heart, and spinal cord intact. Error configuring the AI to human qualities. Initiating protocol. Tabula rasa. Brain wiped. AI preserved. Process complete. Huh. Cause that's me. My UI is a little confusing. Pretty cold start though. Not sure where I'm going or what I'm doing. Huh. And I don't think I really have a map. At least from what I can tell. I could be wrong. Connect. Save. Analyze. Augment. Looks like a leftover message. Dated 38 days ago. Everyone is gone. I just woke up and expected everyone to be up at the same time as me. I don't like this. The cryo bed was scheduled way ahead of the planned time. This doesn't make any sense. I've been wandering around the place to see nothing but security machines patrolling around. What is there to protect? There was nothing in the plans about needing security. Incoming message. Is the galaxy no longer at peace? Help. Me, please. That voice is a human. 
The message came from somewhere on this floor. Reanalyze. Augment. Got something here. Keycard. And we got a map. Sweet. So is there a color code? Current room in progress, 100%. Access denied. Access denied. We got it. Machine! Ah! So we gotta go here. Go right. Nope. Mechanism. We have a locked door to the right and things we can go on the left here. What the? Huh. Limited use? Booster. I designed the Ian system to give a boost to when you just need that extra power in desperate situations. Vaulting over barriers, breaking debris, lifting objects, or anything emergency related. There's a backup if you run out of EN, but it recharges slowly. Though to recover the EN loss, we also create a portable booster. It's still a prototype, but should be enough for about three uses. Please access the optical course if you want to try it out. Oh, thanks. I have access to a gym now. Ah, oh, yeah, I see how it works. So it's like the bare minimum. Door unlocked. No, I don't see anything blocking me from going here. Oh, yeah, that's locked too. And we need a key card for that one. Is this the obstacle course you speak of? No, there is machines that want to eat me. This map... Actually, I'm not quite sure where I am. Let's go in here. This must be the obstacle course you're talking about. Yep. Took a hit. Go north. Connect. Analyze. This entry is dated 35 days ago. I managed to actually find some people and took refuge in the living district. Something feels off, though. Everything I keep bringing up about my awakening and the abandoned plans for this place have fallen on deaf ears. I know there's less and less people every day. I keep asking to see my Ganymede. My assigned role was to regulate his sub its subsystems. People keep redirecting me to a robotic representative that puts me in a frustrating questionnaire to nowhere. It's frustrating. I'm the one who designed the most important system for the city. And I'm now being regulated to low IT jobs. I designed the log this with an encryption from the surface. Nothing here would be able to decode this without some magical time machine. Or I guess... never mind. Go on. Stim pack. Some more items. Useful. Access log one. Do not press off. All right, who the hell installed the spikes in the course? Nice. Uh, I didn't know this was pre-installed when I got here. Then why is it taken out? There's a weird safeguard that prevents me from changing it. Weird. Also, do we need these security walkers standing around everywhere? They creep me out. I've had to eat people too. I just want to take a jog around the gym. I'll look into it. Hey Jan, I managed to toggle the uh, bomb drones off for now. To bomb drones? For whatever reason, the walker has access to the room that can disable them permanently. If only I had the clearance, we're just gonna have to destroy it. Maybe using the spike flooring. Maybe last security guard to lend me the sonic drawn thing. That should act as a taser and make it vulnerable to the spikes. Are they able to function? Do not press. So hopefully no one is dumb enough to trigger it. Janice, you there? Dead. Cool. Connect. 
Lost style. Lost style in this game. Ow. Come on. Not trying fast enough. Oh, you nicked me for the... Door unlocked. Sweet. I'm in your mind. Curious what that was. We're in red health. We're kind of hurt bad. Storage. Sprint mod. Nice. Allows you to sprint. Press C. Yeah, that's helpful. I'm gonna consume one of these stim packs. Be back in orange. What does bullets? This place is a death trap. There's loot over there, though. <laughs> Gotta get that loot. <laughs> Collected artifact. Don't know what it's for, but now I need to get out of here alive. Yeah, this, uh... Yeah, I'm not sure they are. I guess they're just a collectible. This, uh, map has not been quite useful for quite some time. Ten key card. Sweet, thanks. Cool. There is a Sonic Tron. Inventory full. Eat that. X open inventory. Sun's so enemy, no damages. Six uses. Can I blow this up? Back up! I mean, we don't need to stun this one. There's no spikes here we can uh, fully use, it looks like. So I will conserve my um, ammo. Nice. Nice to die there. I'm assuming this key card was only for there. That's just like, yeah, that's just straight access denied. Stim pack. Do have green health. Looks kind of like a boss fight room. Secret. I kind of figured there was something down here. Don't be a trap. Because that wouldn't be cool. Nexus. Long ago, a group of settlers created a city to the east. Much later, deserters broke away from the city, made their own settlement to the west. To the south, a strange signal emerges with no clear reason to its origin. And finally, to the north, organic-like machines slowly corrupt what's left. That just sounds swell for all you all. Sure was a great time. Hmm. Consume.
Guess we gotta do this puzzle. Nope. Yep. We're good. Stuff behind over there. Next marks a spot indeed. We destroyed droids. Huh. Ah! Yeah, these things are always easy. Connect. Inventory expanded. Thank you very much. This inventory is way, very limiting. But now we're... Door unlocked. I should go back and maybe get this booster over here. That I got bigger inventory. There we go. If I find a storage thing, I can at least like put it away for the time being. Huh. I'm trying to figure out where we are. So we're on four two zero three. Um, everything around is, like, locked. So... Yeah. Dead droid, I'm assuming. No go over there, either. Connect. Got storage locker on the right, too. Analyze. This entry is dated two hours ago. Hmm. I tried to go through with the injection, but no dice. It found its way to me. I don't know how. I've encrypted everything, including this log entry. The only way it could have interrupted the process would be from something from the surface, but that's impossible. Anything from the surface would either be inoperable or here by now. I'm going to try again. I've sacrificed too much to give up now. But I don't know what I'm sacrificing this all for. Save. Got my inventory. Let's put away some stuff. Uh, keep the stim pack for emergencies. Put the booster I've used a little bit of away. Camera mod. Stimpak. Okay. Access to nine. That's a health pack, health pack. Aid max. This is not a boss fight, is it? Because there is a lot of stim packs around here. And there is a key card. And, uh, yeah. There's a lot of things going on here. Which is a little unsettling. Interesting. Well, I don't have the inventory to grab that last thing, so let's put something away. Let's see. One use. Use key card. Well, there's never a key card there. Key card for the key card! Do you want me to... yeah. Okay... Gotcha. Number lock disabled. There could still be a boss fight in that area, I might just need to disable all the locks. Kind of a key card. Can I pop you over here? Yep. We g Hmm. Not sure if those are dangerous or not. 
best, uh... Yep. Boom, boom, boom. I can use these things to my advantage. That saved me ammo. Connect. What am I doing? Like, downloading, like, your information? It's like a fighting game. You've been downloaded. Keycard. Unlock that. Never locked down. Got something over here. Someone's been trying to sabotage the air supply unit. I suspect it's an employee of... Desim? Mainly due to the worker revolts. But you know, that's just me and my theories. I'll talk to the security chief about this. I don't know where we stand given that we also work for Desim. The many lives are at stake. I don't know if there's much of a choice. Um... I mean, yeah, we're, we're pretty much done here. Did you come back? No, I just ported your body over there, I think. Yeah. Okay. Uh, and we have another key card. We can probably employ it over here. You're still acting dormant. I know for a fact. You're probably going to come to life at some point. Try this? Okay. It's it's interesting, and let's kind of scout it out, but like it's also so distorted that um, you don't fully... It's not like a complete sheet. It just gives you like a general idea, like, all right, here's my patrol route. Here's what I got to do. Very interesting. Go, 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 go. Ouch, 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 ouch. Stop it. I'm trying to, like, not use ammo. Very conservative in these survival horror games. Thank you. What's over there? It's gotta be, like, a secret or something. Yes. Secret. Enough for me. Uh, we're not quite done yet, though. We have to go for the lower door. Just did that chance to, like, pull out. P ammo? Hmm. That's the last lock. Thank you. And we've made a full loop. Yeah, swell. Yes, of course. Put some stuff away. Uh, we have, um... Stim packs in our inventory. Take one. Juice up. Keep my inventory pretty light. I'm gonna put the camera mod back in the, uh, box. Because especially if there's like an enemy or some kind of coming up, I'm gonna want to be able to like get healing items or find things on the field. Basically. Pistol. Oh yeah. And you are able to kill things later, I guess. This doesn't open from this side anyways, so Yeah. I did leave one healing item left in this area. Let me grab that. Thank you. And let's go through here. More pistol ammo. Step on that. Step on that. Hmm. Feels kind of dangerous here. A mod. Inventory full. Oh, damn. These things aren't stacking. A mod. Oh, so move while aiming. That's pretty useful. The odds take up like an inventory slot. So, um... 
there's a little trickiness to it. Huh. Can't get that. That's concerning. Can you blow up for me and... Yep, that's what I thought. You all ain't got any of them pistols? You know, like actual weapons that destroy? Hmm. Hello. Well, I'll keep the Sonictron and then like you can switch to the pistol. After it's done. Whoa, oh, 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 no, you don't xenomorph me. I'm going to the end of the demo. Don't forget to wish list the game. Dang, that was just getting good. Then we got to use the pistol. So that's it for the Machine That Breathes demo. Uh, so I actually went back and confirmed some things. I'm not sure the exact date when this game started development, but I'm seeing like news posts from 2019. So I was right, because I have been following this game for a while, because it looked fairly interesting. And, you know, I like the, the RPG Maker style games, obviously, is kind of where the channel started at. And I think it's doing some things that are different than the standard formula, obviously. It's not doing the uh, run around scared kind of pixel horror game, the top down view one. Uh, it's throwing a little bit of combat. It's, you know, got the survival horror thing going on. Content that's in the demo wise, we only covered one style of enemy, although one was kind of hinted at. So we're getting a very small, very opening slice of the game. So we can't fully feel out, like, how does the whole game, like, play out? Like, does it get really difficult? Are the enemies, like, going to do a lot of dynamics? Stuff like that. But I feel like the developer, just going by the posts I see and everything, is very passionate about the project. And it's, you know, it's got a good aesthetic. It seems fairly unique. And the writing I've seen so far was good. So that's about all I can say. I mean, it's just never a game I'll be looking forward to until the eventual full release. Anyway. So thank you all for watching you play the Machine That Breathes demo. I'll see you guys later, and take it easy.